March 2023 has been the month with lots of announcement related to AI and beyond. Talk in this video about the announcement that Google did yesterday about the BARD, which is the language model and it's in the experimental phase right now. And at the same time, there is also the announcement from Microsoft yesterday saying that now we can create images already on the chat, in the Bing chat. I'm here in the official website blog.google and it, this says that okay try BARD and share your feedback. Let's click this first news here. Okay they say that we are starting to open access to BARD and all the experiment that lets you collaborate with generative AI. We are bringing with the US and UK and will expand to more countries and languages over time. So now it's basically only on US and UK and you need to be in the waiting list also to assess that. So they said that today, yeah, again, the announcement, the experimental phase, yeah, it's, it's similar to chat GPT or GPT-4, let's say, that you can have a conversation with a chatbot. So that's how it works. It says that we can access into bard.google.com. So let's go to bard.google.com. Okay, it says bar experiment. And here, okay, we need to sign in, of course. And it says join waitlist. Let's click the join waitlist. Yeah, you need to sign in. So you get the idea that you go to bard.google.com and then be on the wait list. And once you get approved, you can explore the new Bard from Google, which they claim that it's better. But from the news I am seeing in the internet who already used Bard, it's not that impressive news. So let's say I, I cannot explore because I'm, I'm in the waiting list. I will create a video once I get approved. But you get the idea that you need to be in a waiting list first to get assist and once you get approved you can go and explore how BARD is or how it is different from chat GPT or GPT. Now let's go and see the news from Microsoft. Microsoft yesterday as Google announces something Microsoft is always there to haunt them. They say that create images with your words. Bing image creator comes to the new Bing. So now you can already create images in the new Bing chat. I have already created a video how you can assess Bing chat and all the related materials with Bing chat. I will link the, uh, it in the description. You can go and watch that. There are many things on the article, but the main thing that what I find interesting is this paragraph here, which says that they are using the Dell E model from the OpenAI. So that model is what is being used to convert the text into the images. But now let's go to the Bing chat, right? They said that we can assess it from the Bing chat, right? I am in the age and I'm already logged in with the account that I'm approved so that I can use the Bing chat. So now I let's go to the Bing. It's here in the search. So bing.com. Yeah, I can go to the website. And here let's go to the chat icon here. If I go to the chat icon, this is how the Bing chat looks like. And they say that this is available only in the creative conversation style as of March 22, 2023. Now let's go and ask here something. Can you create an image of cute dog in the garden? Let's just ask this simple question. And then let's submit it. Let's see if it is capable of creating an image as they said in the announcement. Okay, it says, I'm sorry, but I cannot create an image of a cute dog in the garden. I can only communicate with you through text. They say that we can create the image, but it's not rolled out for all the users, I guess. Now let's also go to this. There is this discover icon here. Let's ask the same question here. It says, sure, I can create an image of a cute dog in the garden using Bing image creator. Here is what I came up with. So yeah, this is what they create here in this uh, discover channel, discover button and in the chat. So here in the left side, in the main chat, it is not able to create, but in this sidebar where there is this discover icon and the chat icon, it is able to create, but you see how it is being created. Now let's go to the website where we can create, the, by the way, we can create the image. It's not in the chat function yet. But if you go to bing.com and then in the create, if you enter, here you can actually create what they mentioned that we can create the image. It says image creator and Microsoft Bing. And it says, okay, there are many different images that is created by AI. And we can click with some of those. But let's see the same example that we copied. 
can you create an image of a cute dog in the garden let me create this let's also copy this for now so that we will ask it after it creates our first image let's see if it creates our image or not so you see this, this is what it comes so the first two seems of course the doll but the last two bottom here it seems that a cute dog right it says here created with ai i haven't tried other different platforms like mid journey and other places where you can create the image with text but for me at least this looks okay i i don't have any use case where i will be using this it's just for fun and using the new technology that is being developed daily by the way nowadays let's just paste the thing that we just copied and let's create this one and yeah it, and when it is creating something it will provide you some tip that okay describe the illustration styles like pixel art and all these things so that it creates the image in a, in a different way so if you provide this prompt it will create this kind of image also let's see with this prompt here and you can also try so i, I will not go through many examples but let's see how this text provides okay it's it's fun right it's just for fun so it's not that uh, something different or we want something different from from this ai but it's just for fun so yeah this is just a short video i want to create about these two different announcements that went yesterday on march 21 i hope you liked it and explore it why i create this video is just to let you know that there is something that they are developing it is being developed so that we can use it right so we can use and if you have any use case you can implement that otherwise just have fun going through the website and creating some different things yeah thank you for watching and see you in the next video